Hey guys, it's Karen. Welcome back to Little Art Talks. Today, let's talk about what are ready-mades and why they're considered works of art. Now, the definition of ready-mades itself isn't very difficult to understand. They're works of art made from manufactured objects, things that are already made right? Pretty straightforward. What's usually a little bit more difficult to understand is how or why these objects are considered works of art. The term ready-made was first used by French artist Marcel Duchamp. The earliest ready-made included Bicycle Wheel of 1913 and In Advance of the Broken Arm of 1915. Bicycle Wheel is a bicycle wheel mounted on a wooden stool and In Advance of the Broken Arm is an inscribed snow shovel. However, Duchamp's most notorious ready-made came in 1917 when he created the fountain. The fountain was a men's urinal that was placed on its back, then signed by the artist with a false name. Duchamp deliberately chose ordinary, functional, and rather dull objects. He chose objects based on a reaction of visual indifference, with at the same time a total absence of good or bad taste. In the May 1917 issue of the avant-garde magazine The Blind Man, which is run by Duchamp and two of his friends, an anonymous editorial explained the theory behind the ready-made. Whether Mr. Mutt with his own hands made the fountain or not has no importance. He chose it. He took an ordinary article of life and placed it so that its useful significance disappeared under the new title and point of view created a new thought for that object. Here they make a case for the fountain with three main points. First, the act of choosing the object is a creative act in itself. Second, by removing its useful function of an object, it becomes art. Third, by presenting the object with a title in a gallery, the object is given a new thought or new meaning. These ready-mades assert the idea that art is defined by the artist as opposed to being determined by its media. The role of artist changes from maker of art to chooser of art, a trend that is often seen as the beginning of the movement to conceptual art. At the time, ready-made was perceived as an assault on the conventional understanding of not just the status of art, but also of its very nature. Since its first controversial presentation as an art object in 1917, Duchamp's Fountain has provoked lively discussion about art, ideas, and meaning. While the term was first invented by Duchamp to describe his own works, it has since been used more generally for artworks made from manufactured objects. For example, works by young British artists such as Damien Hirst, Michael Landy, and Tracy Emin. I hope this video helped you better understand ready-mades. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos on art history. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.